With the recent release of Windows 11, Microsoft is making it more difficult to log in without an email account. In this demonstration, I will show you how to work around the issue and make a clean install with a local account instead. Before you get started, check for updates on your current system. You'll receive a message indicating your PC is compatible or the PC does not meet system requirements for Windows 11. Another method is to download the compatibility check and run on your computer. I will place the link below. Next, insert at least an 8GB USB flash drive into your computer. Go to Microsoft's website and select Create Windows 11 Installation Media. It is free and will include most versions of Windows 11. Allow at least one hour to download and install on the flash drive. I will place a link below. I will demonstrate the Windows installation on a new Lenovo desktop with an AMD Ryzen 5 3400G processor which had Windows 10 Home Premium installed. It has both Wi-Fi and Ethernet connections. We will be doing a clean install of Windows 11. This will eliminate the manufacturer's copy of Windows. The same procedure applies if using a laptop. Insert the LAN cable from your modem into your computer. You must do this step. By not connecting the LAN cable, Microsoft will force you to enter your password into your internet provider's Wi-Fi account. Then you will be asked to provide an email account in order to continue with the installation. For local account, we don't want this to occur. The next step is to set the boot order as we want to start from the flash drive. Switch on the computer and start tapping the F12 key. Check the manufacturer's website for boot order information for your computer as each brand differs. The boot order will display. Select the flash drive. The Windows language pane will display. At this point, we will format the hard drive using disk part. Hold the shift key along with the F10 key and release. This will take you to the administrator command prompt. Type disk part, press enter. Wait for disk part to appear below. Then type LIS DIS, which is short for list disk. Press enter. This PC has two hard drives. I will install Windows on the solid state drive. Select the drive where you intend to install Windows 11. In this case, disk 1 is for the solid state drive. Type SEL DIS 1, then press enter. Type the word clean. Press enter. At this point, there's no turning back as this step will completely wipe the hard drive. Then type convert GPT, press enter. This part, type exit, press enter. And again at leaving this part, type exit, press enter. Windows setup pane will display. Click install now. The operating system pane may display. Click on the operating system you intend to install. Do not select the Pro version if you had the Home Premium version activated on the previous system. The Pro version will not activate with the Home Premium product key. You may or may not see this pane. It is likely to default to Windows 11 Home or the product key version which is stored on the computer. Agree to the license terms. Which type of installation do you want? Select Custom. Select which drive to install Windows. In this case, we will select drive 1, the SSD drive. Installing Windows. It'll take a couple minutes to complete. Computer needs to restart. At this point, remove the flash drive. 
Select your keyboard layout and then click Yes. Add a second layout or click Skip. Select your country. Select a name for the PC, such as Lenovo PC. System will restart. Let's add a Microsoft account. Pause here as we don't want to add an account. Remove the LAN cable, then click the back arrow located in the top left hand corner. Who is going to use this device? Enter a username. Enter a password. Your choice is not necessary. Click Next. Windows is getting things ready for you. This may take several minutes to complete. Out the Windows home screen, connect to your Wi-Fi or plug in the LAN cable. For a Wi-Fi connection, click the globe on the taskbar, select your internet provider account and enter the password. To check that the local account is enabled, Click the Windows icon on the taskbar, then click Settings. Look for the local account displayed in the top left hand corner. On the left, click on Accounts for further options. Task completed. Your Windows 11 installation is set up with a local administrator account.